Good morning. It is the first day of Contemporary Thon. I just dropped the kid off, uh, so we're gonna get some reading done. But the demanding dog, right there. You want in? It's kind of cold out. What are you doing? <laughs> Woo! Oh, now he's up on your toy. All right, ah, time to go upstairs, get some reading done. I will be reading the Mighty Anchor by Carrie Ehrens and um, the Imperfect Guy by Letty Harper today, as well as probably listening to the Read Me Romance, a podcast story. Yay, so excited. So let's get to contemporary -thon. Okay, completely, I'm in bed, if you haven't figured it out yet. Completely forgot that I was in the middle of reading um, Irish on the Rocks by Megan Avernon. Duh, that's what I will be finishing uh, before I get to those other two books that I named off earlier. Um, but I want to get through like four books today, so let's see if I can do it. All right, in my car, getting ready to go get the kid, taking a break. I finished one book already um for contemporary -thon, as well as that book is part of uh buzzword -thon, which was irish on the rocks and it was so good so very good um megan vernon was new to me i won a giveaway for her and then her books finally popped up or popped up on Hoopla Digital and I started listening to them and I was like, yes, sir. Yes, please. These are amazing. What is going on? So awesome. And um, so I'm super excited about that. Make sure. great got all these crazies um so yeah meg mernon amazing and the narrators that they got for this book as well were fantastic oh my gosh so it's a younger um younger brother's friend type story that um you know they knew each other when they were kids and now they're older and if you know anything about the murphy brothers they know you know that they had to they have to get married in order to take over their family company and because their father died and that's what he put in his will and oh sweet jesus it's so bright um so it's a lot of fun i really 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 enjoyed it it rained it looks like oh, sweet lord Oh, come on. Dang it. Stinking people. I might have to wait on this. Yeah, I'll check back with you guys. I got to concentrate on the road. All right, it's probably going to be like super dark when we got out here. I know it will be because it's like five o'clock and he just went in for swim practice and um, the, the it's getting dark. That sunlight that you guys saw in the last clip lasted like that. It was like... Oof, right in your face and then it was gone now it's gone completely gone so we're at the pool going to swim practice i finished one book already um i will probably finish the second book during swim practice which is the imperfect guy by letty harper really enjoying this i love letty's flair on bringing in complicated characters and you know the fun and the sexy and the quirky and all of that goodness so yes 
two books already sort of down um, for contemporary thon and loving it, loving it. Swim practice, done, over with. Didn't take any footage because I was so concentrated on getting my third book for um, Contemporary Athon done, which was amazing. It, uh, that way, yep. It was The Mighty Anchor by Carrie Ahrens, which is the third book in the Rogue Academy series. Yay, so good, loved it. Oh, so much. If you want a grizzly bear sort of um, goalie guy that has is really quiet and reserved and just so sweet and just melts your heart and stuff like that. And it's a secret baby. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. So if you love secret babies, this is a book for you. Go check that out. So like I said, that's the third book for Contemporary Thought. And it technically could go into Contemporary Thought or buzzword a thon because it is the third book in the rogue academy series and i'm pretty sure it says rogue academy number three on the front of the title Yay. so uh the one back there that's hiding that you can't see today um is asking to go to the mall but we're not going to the mall because i have more reading to do okay totally forgot to vlog last night totally forgot to vlog earlier but i am sitting at my computer right now in my chair doing weekend stuff, um, getting today's video prepared, which is Sunday, the weekly weekly wrap up uh, needs to go up and hopefully I can get that done and out to you guys and then get a couple more books done for Contemporary Athon and Buzzword Athon, which the count right now is five books for contemporary thon and four books for buzz word thon no i said that backwards four books for contemporary thon five books for buzz word thon so whew, i will go through all those after i get this done i'll see you guys then
Whew. All right, closing out the Contemporary Athon Weekend Edition wrap up thing. Yeah, so I read five books. Um, let's see. Amazing. Pretty good weekend. Uh, some of them were a flop, but some of them were really, really good. And you guys would have seen them in last week's, last weekend's week, read it, the wrap up thing. Yeah. Um, but yeah, five done. You guys can see them. Put them there. <laughs> right there, those are the five. Uh, the only one that you guys will be hearing about next week uh, during the weekly wrap up is The Bridal Suite by Rochelle Ehlers. That's the only one. Otherwise, you guys have already heard about the other ones. The other four were already in last week's weekly wrap up. So let me know how you guys did down in the comment section. I uh, hope you enjoyed this vlog. You guys saw that I did a lot of stuff this weekend. Um, but yeah, or maybe you didn't. I can't remember how many clips I did or what clips I did. Anyways, if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Also, there's a feedback form down in the description box so you guys can help me improve my channel. There's also a whole bunch of other good stuff down in that description box as well. Thank you for watching and we will see you guys later. Mm -hmm.